that same thing again. Yeah. In the top left, it's gonna be you are in your bikini. And then on the bottom right, we have SPN Archimedes, and I'm really hoping Archimedes can. You know, we didn't we didn't get to see any. Any, we didn't see any builds, we didn't see any skill. The The game ended so fast, so I want to see what Archimedes can do. If we can maybe get some Hellbat drops, if we can see some something going on. Yeah. It'd be... The problem with games like this, and a, a best of three is if you get... It wasn't even cheese. If you lose really... If you lose really fast, oh. and you... You know, that, that'll mess up your mindset. That all, and you also don't get to see your opponent's style. You don't actually see what builds they have planned. So you don't see anything from them. Archimedes does go into this game still like a game one, where he's a bit blind on his style. He doesn't know how New Beginning plays at all. I guess you could yeah. say that he does get uh, mind games, man. Mind, mind games. Mind oh, man. games. <laughs> so he does go for the standard twelve barracks. And if he gets up gas and there will be a, a reaper. There's only two spots for this reaper to get up on this map, so it's not very good for reaper. Like reaper harass, it, it is being done quite a few times. It's it's decent, but like it's not in comparison yeah. to like Star Station or that. The whole well, the whole main base of Star Station is one cliff, so it, a reaper can get yeah. up anywhere. Yeah, the, especially if you're uh, with with crossbond now, you can come up from behind and just. Don't you don't really know that it's there until it's in your base? Yeah. Because you're not looking at that. Uh, Star Station has that one dark corner where you know you can put a Nidus Worm or you can jump Reapers up or you can drop. And if they don't have anything there, mm. you know, like dropping all, Marines in the dark them. corner, like even here, mm -hmm. even here, are they dropping the mar Marines there and stimming them? Uh, that is. And it's stimming out. Yeah. yeah. Could do if some the damage. If the still stays alive, then the, it would. And if it does damage, then Man, he would have been way ahead. So, Nubugini did go hatch first on this map with a pull behind it. He's going for the fast gas again to get fast speed. Maybe Baneley's mm -hmm. again, you never know. Yeah, fast gas is pretty standard nowadays just because Zergs want to feel safe versus those Reapers. You want to have speed to be able to deal with those. You want to have speed to be able to run across the map and kill the Reapers for harassing you pretty much. Um, Archimedes spots this, he knows what's up, he knows he has to be maybe a little bit careful of what... He's going for the CC on the low ground though. He goes for the CC, but then he goes for the immediate bunker after that, so yeah. he's he's preparing for any shenanigans coming out from Lubergini. No shenanigans, man. He's so shenanigans. A, still for... Oh, he puts up two gas at the same time, so maybe he's gonna go... No idea. <laughs> I yeah. don't. I don't. Play I, I don't Terran. know enough about Terran, Terran to be yeah. able to Here comes to explain what he could be going for. But New Regini, New probably going to poke up here, see what he can do, if he can send a bunch of speedlings in and do some damage again. He's actually not doing that. He's checking. The I don't know what he's doing. He's going for the rocks. So I think his plan is here to is to take advantage of the fact that. This, this is a Terran map, this is a Protoss map, where they can wall off, they can use these rocks to have a really defensible defensible third. As, uh, as Gulian says, let gas, triple CC early. Early Plus, upgrades, yeah. yeah. Or Hellions. But with these Lings, uh, New Brigini is going to be able to break down these rocks, and he'll be able to break down the rocks that come, that fall down, and then when... Archimedes expands, and if he doesn't know that this is this is ready, that this this is a thing, um, New Virginia can just send units through here and kind of surprise Archimedes. There is a scouting reaper going out. New Virginia is taking his third. It's fast. Uh, it's a later third than usual. So I think he realized that um, uh, Archimedes wouldn't go for the triple CC. Looks uh, like again, the Queens are going to defend from the Reaper, so he's not going to get any scouting information. He's going to go yep. home all alone and sad. <laughs> Looks yeah, like he's got two, like, two bunkers up. He's natural. like, sorry guys, couldn't do anything. He's going to salvage that. Yeah, there, I mean, there's no reason to 
not get these bunkers if you're not sure of your opponent's place yeah. play style if you want to feel extra safe. Did you, you see that, that you got this? Huh? Did you see that? He, oh, you didn't see that you got the third hatch down, so... He has the know. scouted. Looks like he's... Is he going for Bluefin Harley? Uh... Looks like it, actually, because we yeah. have the... We have the the tech lab and the two factories, so we're gonna have a blue flame heli. It could be, we could be seeing a blue flame heli and marauder push. I'm not really sure. I know heli and marauder was yeah. very pre prevalent in um, Wings of Liberty, but we do have that triple that next CC going down, the third CC. So thank God this Gullahin's here. here. What's up? Thank oh, God Gullahin's here. He can he can help us with this. With this Terran, yeah, this Terran that we don't know, still going after the rocks. Mm -hmm. So the first two Helens are going to go and see if they can. Maybe gonna see if they can kill a few drones. Yeah, they're actually gonna sit there and chill. <laughs> they're just like, "What's up, queens? Yeah, can we be your friends? What's up, queens? Can we can we just party oh, together? Oh, like, here we get. He knows the Helen friends are coming play. along. And here we get like three quarters yeah. done. Now we're getting plus one plus one for melee, and he's getting his lair. So versus blue flame, this could be somewhat of an issue because he if he doesn't get any good surrounds, Archimedes could just roast through everything. Nubrigini was able to break down those rocks, and Archimedes actually scouts this, killing off those zerglings. If he would have killed the zerglings there, seeing that if blue flame was done, then I think that uh, Nubrigini would have thrown down a few more. Spines yeah, and maybe got the roach some one spines and roaches. He's getting bane right now. Yeah. Going pretty standard. He's getting that macro hatch as well. Nubergini's just macroing up, playing Zerg, doing what Zerg does and macroing up. I'd expect him uh, to go for an attack with the both of the right now since both of them have just finished. Mm -hmm. I th he might be a little bit worried because of the four queens, all this creep spread. This is really good creep spread coming yeah. out of Nubergini. He'll be able to have a lot of vision. He'll be able to see the blue flame hellions before they get there, pretty much. And so we don't. There's an infestation pit. Yeah, Nubergini being a little cocky, putting down some more lings underneath Archimedes' command center so it can't land. So he's delaying that third even more. Uh, Archimedes is just going for a, a barracks, barracks tank, marine tank. Play, it looks like with Metabanks. This is pretty Wings of Liberty style. Doesn't look, doesn't look like he's gonna go Widow Mines. He might not. He might be one of those players that doesn't like the Widow Mines. The upgrades for Archimedes, though, they're they're quite a bit behind. Yeah, uh, Nubergini's actually started mainly speed two plus two plus two. So he's he's pretty far ahead macro wise. He's getting centrifugal hooks. So. Like if he does get the fungals down, yeah, he's he's got pathogen glands. If he gets the fungals down, the banelings are going to be able to take out that army pretty fast. Yeah, he's getting pathogen glands and the carapace for the speed. This is going to be well. If I'm just surprised Archimedes hasn't pushed yet. Yeah, he has blue flame. He's going to have plus one, plus one soon. He's moving I over think the hell just right now. I think he was just worried about the creep spread with the. Zerg, the Overlord, sorry, pipping out. It spreads creep on his fourth, so he can't take his fourth anytime soon. Is he is he getting a fourth command center? Doesn't seem uh, like there it so far. Doesn't yeah, it doesn't look like there's a fourth command center underway just yet. He's gonna get he might be going for some for tanks. Might be going yeah for a large three base, maxed out push, and he's ahead, army wise. Mm. He's ahead. He's almost, he's only six workers behind Nubergini, but... In this uh, situation, I don't know if Nubergini should be behind in supply, though. Mm -hmm. like, that's not what you want to be, is it? Like, you always want to be ahead in supply. He's, uh, his queens were able to push out those blue flame hellions, and Nubergini actually has nine infestors on the way, and a roach ward. Yeah. So I think Nubergini might be a little bit worried of... Mech he sees coming. the tank play. He sees the marine tank play. Right. So the oh, roach worm was a good idea. Change. Yeah. Yep. These queens are just shining there. And Nirugini is on lair. He just hit lair and he's getting the ultraless cavern. He's got and the adrenal glands. Yeah. The well the, the adrenal glands and burrow for his spawning pool. The spawning 
the adrenal glands and these circlings are really going to help the attack by 20%. And if yeah. Archimedes doesn't do anything soon, he's going to have a lot of Ultralisks that are plus two, plus two, just barreling down his throat. And that's, you know, you don't want that. Those Ultralisks are I think so. With a... He has two, too. So if he doesn't start 3-3 three, three soon, then uh, I think uh, Archimedes will catch up in upgrades. As I say, that's yeah, three, three melee yeah, attacks. Right, that. Said that. <laughs> oh melee my attack luck, step. he's getting roach speed right now. This creep spread is insane. It's insane. Yeah. That's what those four queens do for you. Mm -hmm. They drop. That's a, that's a style from a lot of uh, from a lot, a lot of zergs. I've seen um, sort of does a four queen style. Yeah, you want to be able to have that vision. You want to know when the Terran's moving out. So Archimedes is maxed, and New Regini is down he's 135. 70, the army is 127. Yep. Yeah, I don't think you would want to be that. I can't do math. 65 supplies, sorry. I don't think I he'd think want to the be there. Was... Oh, and he oh, gets he's actually going to yeah. try and get us around on the hell. A blue flame, though. Yep. Man. And he the thing is with Zerg is, with all this money in his bank, all the larva that he has, he has 44 larva, larva, so he can make 88 zerglings with all this money. And that's a lot of zerglings. Oh, and uh, those Archimedes things. is moving out right now. Oh, we do the have fungal? Archimedes. Oh, the fungal goes down. Oh my gosh. Who a said few army. fungal got nerfed? These are some amazing fungals by New Regini. He's able to kill a lot of Oh, marines. he's losing he's three losing infestors. For it. That's bad though. But all the marines it's, just explode. It's worth it. Yep. He's getting Kite in his planking for the Ultralisks right now, and he's got two Ultralisks in there. Two Ultras and 96 Zerglings on the way. Yeah. So as long as New Regini can hold off with these Fungals, fungals keep the Oh my god, all those, all those Zerglings. The Zerglings, the Zerglings with the, adre the Adrenal Glands, uh, not the, I don't know if Adrenal Glands, but the Zerglings with the, the attack speed and the Ultralisks and everything. New Regini's going for it. The tanks are only plus one. And I don't think there's All the enough. All the tanks are going down right now. Yeah. New Brigini able to max out with his bank and his supply was able to crush through Archimedes army. Archimedes doesn't have the money. Well, he has the money. He doesn't have the production, unfortunately. Oh, is he going to take out this, this fifth base? There is a drop going on trying to deny New Brigini's fifth base. Oh, the fifth base doesn't go down. Those, Close. those ultralists just cleave right yeah. through it. And the spore crawlers. Five more ultralists on the way. And that medevac actually survives. The spine crawler stabbing away at these marines. The marines don't survive and then. Oh, and the medevac is down there. Not a long life for that medevac. So you're beginning transitioning to Greater Spire. He's almost maxed out. He has creep spread everywhere. And Archimedes, his push wasn't... He's not wasn't denied any of this at all. He's not denied any of the creep spread. Yep. He, he let the Zerg sit there and macro up, unfortunately, and you can't do that with the Zerg who knows how to macro. They'll just make plenty of Oh, games. and he, th <laughs> he denies the landing of the... Yep. Oh, and he borrows it as well. let that finish. Yeah. I mean, he's trying to get rid of some of the creep, but he gets surrounded by Zerglings. He's throwing down two more. The infestors with max turns. energy, they might be able to pop off a few fungals and the Zergling flood. I think he, he might just be able to run all the lings in and just Destroy. He doesn't. Ha oh, he has a uh, four tanks. Then I, I only seen two. He has there's, a lot of ultralists. There's four so. tanks on the high ground. Yeah. But with these ultralists being able to tank, they're five three ultralists, able to rip through everything. The infestors being able to lock down all the marines and the tanks, and the banelings coming up to explode, and the zerglings with the uh, that fifth is still not got down. Oh, he's he's fifth spreading creep hasn't on gone the down. fifth. Archimedes is boosting over to try and deal with that. Mm. It looks like Rudini is gonna push. The tanks were on siege. There we go. It's, the tanks the being able to... going down on the Marines. I think this is, this is the turns. The, the last ultra call. lists. The ultra lists tanking the tanks. <laughs> ripping and <laughs> ripping right through the Marines. And the infestors not even doing anything. They're just bit burrowed. Watching the oh, he's canceling the production as well. Don't just clean everything up. There's a great use of uh, contaminate. Zergs don't really do that too often, but I don't even think it matters. 
New Brigini is ahead. 87 army is supplied to 49. And there is a drop at New Brigini's fourth. Oh, Clearing it does it take down. Of Thank you, Gilly. Doesn't, doesn't fight. That's enough. Uh, New Brigini has 8,000 minerals, which you can just pre max with Zerglings. Yeah. The drop in the main might get the spawning pool. And there's another drop going into the natural clearing out. He's actually sniping all the important tech structures right now, but there's just too many ultras cleaving through everything in Archimedes' base. Uh, ultras spawn in the natural and the, the main, and they're able to take care of these marines. The marines are 3 3 now, but it's not enough. Nurgini is able to overwhelm the Terran forces. So